Poke the boo-boo, climb through your window, scooping up the children and biting off their heads. All right, guys, I am so excited about what's in this box right here. It just arrived on my doorstep right here, right now, today, by the FedEx guy. And I am so ready to tear it open and show you what it is. Of course, you already know what it is if you've seen the title and the thumbnail. Guys, holy crap. Boom. That's right. Clowning around from Spirit Halloween for 2024. Yes, now I know this is a re-release, guys. But it is one that I did not buy when it was first released. And it has been selling on eBay for $750 to $1,000 or more. So when I saw that Spirit Halloween was re-releasing it, I jumped on a website and I bought it within minutes. I cannot even tell you how excited I am right now, guys, to have this. If you've been watching this channel for a while, you know that I absolutely love the props that have screaming children. So this is absolutely hilarious. Spirit Halloween, clowning around, head and body turned side to side with light up eyes, speaks creepy phrases while the children flail. Look at that, flailing children. Stands seven feet, four inches tall. This is what the side of the box looks like. This is what the back of the box looks like. Clowning around, and there is his little explanation for how he came to be and why he is the AAA Big Top Babysitting Service. And, of course, the other side, and we get some good close-up pictures. Look at the teeth on that guy. He definitely needs the Aquafresh. And look at those hilarious screaming children. It's kind of funny also how closely he resembles the Terrifier, which amazingly is another animatronic that is coming out from Party City this year, but that's a whole nother video in itself. And I know the lighting is kind of weird right here with the sun shining down. I'm on my back deck in front of the hot tub, but I did not want to wait until I could go to the storage unit to open this guy. So let's just get down to it right here, right now. Holy crap, guys. Mm -hmm. I am so excited for the 2024 Halloween season. There are so many cool props coming out. We've already got two of them from Spirit Halloween. This one and Rick Ratman, which will be coming up very, very shortly. Yeah, did you think I would pass that one up? Heck no. Hello, rat. Okay, so we have the instructions here. Let's pull out his head first. Ah! <laughs> here he is, the clowning around head. Look at that face. Oh my gosh, that has got to be one of the spookiest animatronic faces I have ever seen in my life. Plus, his hat is kind of crushed, so I'm going to have to fix that. Oh, it just Velcros on. What the heck? Okay, hold on. I can't even get it puffed out. Okay, that's better. That's funny how it just Velcros onto the top of his head. Here we go. <laughs> Man, that thing is creepy. Wow, albino eyes. All right, there's the head. We got his outfit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait a minute. A couple pieces of foam here. And if you guys ever need to replace your foam for these animatronics, you can get foam pool noodles at the Dollar Tree for a buck twenty-five. Okay, here comes number one child. Yes! The arm with the screaming child number one. That is hilarious. Oh my gosh. Look at the look on her face. <laughs> she reminds me of Boo from Monsters, Inc. That is so hilarious. So child number one. All right, here we go. Child number two. <laughs> oh my gosh, that is so funny. Look at that. This one reminds me of a toy from the 90s called Baby Tumble Surprise. I love you, Baby Tumble. Okay, Whew. man, I'm having too much fun. Hoop hip. Two shoes. What are those? Power cord. I should start taking notes of how this stuff is packed so I can get it back in the box correctly when I'm done with them. There's our mechanism here with the shoulders, sensor, sound box, bag o poles, and last but not least, clowning's base. Okay, so let's start with the base right here on this table, and then we'll move it off onto the ground as we progress. Make sure we have everything. We got the clothes. We got this, 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 and this. That, 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 and that. We are good to go. And I know I say it in every animatronic video, but props to Spirit Halloween for the awesome instructions. Full color, makes it so easy to see and to read. This is the back right here. Get out of there, ant. 
I don't love you. All right, get our poles out. Our base is A, B's go in next. One, two, shoes are up next. C's after that. Now, usually when I say this, all heck breaks loose and it gets difficult, but this isn't too bad so far. <laughs> Let's go ahead and take them down. Next, our leg foams. Okay. Guys, Halloween is the most fun thing ever. Comment and leave me a thumbs up if you agree. Okay, next up, pants. Pant okay, must be shirt, collar, pants. Now, this is his whole suit right here. That's so cool, I just want to put it on. <laughs> put it on and run around the neighborhood. Okay, so these go on from the top down. Guess nobody taught this guy how to put his pants on. Maybe that's why he turned out evil. All right, I'm getting excited. All right, let's split them up the back. Next up is the mechanism. Man, this guy is tall. Dang. I'm going to have to move him out a little bit. i have to change the angle. In fact, let's just finish with what we're doing right here because I think you guys can see the whole top with how I have it set up at the moment. Power adapter. And drop that down through one of the legs here. Plug that in. I always got to remember to turn these down and only up a little bit because sometimes they're so loud and I know that my one neighbor is out here working in his yard. He hears kids screaming. He's probably gonna call 911 cause shoddy fire burning on that dance flow. <laughs> oh my God, I'm a dork. Okay, we got him turned off for the moment. Here's our sensor. It's gonna go right there. I like how that Velcro's in there. It makes it so easy. We're gonna turn the sensor on because now they want us to pull this up and button them up. Okay. <laughs> so far, so good. All right, we got his vest here. Never dressed a guy with no arms before. <laughs> get these strings off the... Let's get the strings off the balls here. All right, here we go. Child number one, en route. See, this is where it makes it difficult when they tell you to put this on first. Although you can't put this on over the child. So I guess it makes sense. Arm up the back, maybe? At least my arm fits through his entire sleeve here instead of some of these things like Johnny Punk. He's impossible to get his stupid arms on. Send him back to the orphanage after that. Where the heck are the... Oh, right there. I'm going to try to find these holes in here without being able to see them. All right, there's one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Plugging in child number one. All right, child number two. Coming right up. Okay. Where the heck does it go? What in the world? All right, there we go. We got it. Child number two. Plugging in child number two. Oh, my gosh. This thing is so cool. Well, I forgot the hip hoop, but I'm not going to worry about it right now because I'd have to take the children off and take all this apart and put it back on, so forget it. All right, next up, his head. I just, just get a close-up of this, guys. You see that thing? Look how creepy the face on this thing is. I'll show you more in a minute. Let's get him hooked up. All right, head is on. Plugging in the head. <laughs> Make sure I got everything plugged in here and all the wires hooked up, ready to roll. Blah, blah, blah. Everything looks good. Velcro him all up. Velcro his hand up here. Outfit looking good. Your Velcro in here? No, I guess that's just for the cowl. Yeah, okay. So last but not least, got to put his collar or cowl, whatever you want to call it, on. Man, he is tall. He is one tall drink of water. Sorry for pulling your hair, boo. He is the coolest looking thing I've ever seen. <laughs> I would not want to wake up and see him at the foot of my bed. But if I did, I would offer him some aqua fresh. All right, there we go. Get the camera angled down a little bit there. Let me plug him in and we'll see how he goes. Clowning around. Spirit Halloween 2024. Power up. <coughs> The eyes light up too. I never knew that. I never knew the eyes lit up, and I don't know that I've ever even heard all his phrases. Hey now, there's no need to be like that. 
fun to get. have so much fun together. <laughs> well, just you wait. Soon you'll be screaming with happiness. He said, <laughs> We're all having fun now. <laughs> <laughs> His laugh is the greatest. We're all having fun now. <laughs> you two trying to get by me without giving me a hug? Why, you would have hurt my feelings if I had any. Shucks, I'd run away from me too if I could. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I heard somebody talking to me or something during that but man he has a lot of phrases and he just keeps going and going and going Looks like i got some new volunteers for my act <laughs> don't worry now i'm a professional a professional i do wonder though should i juggle you with torches or chainsaws <laughs> they both sound fun to me <laughs> 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 oh my gosh, is that I think that's four different phrases. I mean several different phrases, but within four different uh senses. Hey, you there. I'm trying to figure out what to do with these two little types. But as you can see, they're a bit unwilling to cooperate. So, do I put them in the box? <laughs> or in the box. <laughs> or in the box. <laughs> <laughs> he is the greatest ever, guys. Oh my gosh. Little Uncle Boo Boo climbing through your window, hopping <laughs> up the children and biting off their heads. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Everybody's a critic. <laughs> okay, so let's get a good look at this guy. This, oh my gosh, he is definitely one of my favorite animatronics of all times guys and the phrases i mean he just keeps going and going and going i love it all right let's get a close-up we got the giant feet we're gonna trip the sensor here hey now there's no need to be like that we're gonna have so much fun together <laughs> well just you wait soon you'll be screaming with happiness <laughs> <laughs> See? We're all having fun now. <laughs> I love how this one kicks her feet and this one swings her arms. Hey, you two, trying to get by me without giving me a hug? Why, you would have hurt my feelings if I had any. Shucks, I'd run away from me, too, if I could. <laughs> I want to hear him sing the Uncle Boo Boo song. Looks like I got some new volunteers for my act. <laughs> Don't worry now, I'm a professional. I do wonder, though, should I juggle you with torches or chainsaws? <laughs> they both sound fun to me. <laughs> Little Uncle Boo Boo climbing through your window, scooping up the children and biting off their heads. <laughs> oh, come on. Everybody's a critic. <laughs> Guys, he is so unbelievably awesome. He's so tall, and like, if I put the camera down here, like it's from a small child's view, look how enormous he looks. So. Cool. You know what this makes me want? The towering boogeyman. Hey, you two, trying to get by me without giving me a hug? Why, you would have hurt my feelings if I had any. Shucks, I'd run away from me too if I could. <laughs> Looks like I got some new volunteers for my act. Don't worry now, I'm a professional. I do wonder though, should I juggle you with torches or chainsaws? <laughs> they both sound fun to me! <laughs> hey, you 
there. I'm trying to figure out what to do with these two little types. But as you can see, they're a bit unwilling to cooperate. So, do I put them in the box? Or in the pot? <laughs> I know, right? Either way sounds great to me. <laughs> All right, guys, well, there you go. First hand, you get to see him straight out of the box, clowning around for Spirit Halloween 2024. You don't have to spend $800, $900, or $1,000 on him on eBay. You can go onto the website right now and grab him up. Or I believe he's going to be in stores. I could be wrong about that.